What's up guys, it's Ben Chez and welcome back to Tales from the Borderlands. God, it feels like a whole week has been been passed since I did another episode of this. But we're back, and in the last episode, we finally made it to Helios. We're starting our Ocean's 13 strategy of breaking in and collecting the info that we need. And now, if I remember correctly, we're going to be meeting up with Fiona and Gordis as we go a little bit deeper into our plan. So let's get the episode started, folks. Let's go. Gotta be honest, I kind of missed doing this episode. It's like, I've been so uber busy. I haven't had a chance to play this one out of, over the other videos that I have going up on my channel at the moment. But not to worry, children. We're going to make it through. We're going to get through. We're going to see the rest of this story. I guarantee you that. Come on, loading screen. This is always the awkward moment, guys. There's always, there's always a loading screen. Attention. Don't... Helios is on heightened alert. Uh -oh. Please report any suspicious activity immediately. You think they mean us? I hope not. Uh, what? Fiona? I don't like their faces. They aren't moving. Yeah. Who's this? Uh, she barely looks Hyperion. Mm. Uh, Pretty though. Nice uh, masks. Nice masks. Oh, you think we'd settle for Promethean knockoffs? This is the Handsome Jack VIP experience, baby! Right. Right. Good to see you. So are you going to give us the tour or not? Oh, yeah. Oh. Uh. Uh, yes? You've kept us waiting long enough. Yeah, let's start the tour already. Hey, I first don't appreciate off, your the, attitude. And yeah. I don't appreciate your tardiness. Well, we can't always get what we want, now can we? Handsome Jack always did, and we will too. Alright. VIPs. Well, get ready for a once-in-a-lifetime experience. No, no one notices us. my... No one notices that my face and my name tag don't match. At all. Just pointing that out. Just saying. Yeah, that's the light. Here we go. The uh, first stop of the Handsome Jack VIP experience. It's beautiful, isn't it? This depicts... Oh, I cannot wait to hear about this. Han Ooh. Ah! Handsome, Handsome Jack. Jacks. Defeating... Mm, um... um. Oh, man, what didn't Handsome Jack do? Uh, Ooh! It's a the entire yeah. army of Gremdilius yeah. by rolling over it with a giant eyeball. Huh. What a mess. Whoa. You are totally blowing my mind right now. Wow, I can't believe they're buying it. <laughs> I like how Gordis is actually going along with it, too. It's just like, oh, cool. Quite a sight to behold, isn't it? This, my friends, is... Uh, no freaking way. <laughs> Jack's epic mount. An epic mount that Jack rode into every single battle. And, uh... Um, I wonder if Jack even rode that horse into space battles. <laughs> that sounds uh, dangerous. It grants wishes. Awesome. Whoever rides this horse is granted three wishes. All three of Jack's wishes, naturally, were for more guns. Oh, ingenious. If you'll follow me, we're on to our third and final exhibit. Oh, I can't wait. I always knew I was good um, at BSing people. Uh, yeah, what is this? Ooh. <laughs> uh, kinda just looks like a chair. Uh, uh I think I have one like that in my A office. moment of silence. Look at this chair. Just marvel at it. Stare deeply into its majesty. It's... This empty chair represents that Handsome Jack is no longer with us. Out of respect to Jack, please, be silent and hold all questions. <laughs> Sorry about that. I had to leave my chair for a throne. Uh, catch my drift. Uh, Wait, uh, that wasn't an exhibit at all. Uh, so... Why would you tell us that it is? Boom! Boom gotcha! Gotcha! <laughs> Good one, right? 
All right, enough chit chat. Come on through so you can see Jack's office. Oof. Metal detection. Wait. Oh boy. Walk through the checkpoint. Okay. Yeah. I'm gonna need you to step aside and raise your arms. Oh, I, oh, I knew there was something off about her. Oh, come on, I barely yeah, know she you. She was weirdly ignorant for a guy. Yeah. I don't trust her. That's it, you're banned. You're banned from tours for life. You can't do that. Should have been nicer. I won't stand for this. Tough break, kid. Maybe next time you'll show some respect. Yeah, really. What's this? Uh... It... It was a gift. Yeah, it's a... No metal object. Next time it gets confiscated. Sorry, sir. Sorry. Woo, woo! <laughs> We're almost there. Now for the main event. Even you can't ruin this for me. All right. John, can you ID the beacon? It's got to be in there somewhere. Let me look. Hmm. Can't see it from here. Maybe I can just stop. <laughs> what? Oh boy. I, I I I can't believe we're here. Uh Here it is. Your uh, hero's office. Is it safe to go inside? Uh, uh Gotta be. I paid good money for this. Uh-uh. I want I, the full handsome Jack I really would experience. I really wouldn't that means go going through. all the way. Uh I really wouldn't. Yeah, you know what? We don't need your permission. Force field breach detected. Security lockdown engaged. I warned you. you for taking the oh my god. Oh. VIP oh god. Experience. This isn't a we tour. You it's a goddamn tour. death trap. Goodbye. Okay, uh, let's go. Everybody out. Sorry about I'm your not friend. I'm that shit up again. You got this. No problem. <laughs> That's a heavy duty looking door. That went a lot smoother than I expected. This better work. Okay. 8675309 is the code, right? Damn it. Yeah. Sorry, hold on. Yeah? I can't get into Jack's office. What? You gotta be kidding me. You nope. have one job! Oh, come on! Come on! Some idiot Some triggered the security. on the tour tried to go through before the door was deactivated. I, I, I can't seem to get in. I mean, the, the lockdown security system must be on a local grid or something. Now, so I can understand. It means that we need another way in. Okay, okay, we just, I just need to think about this for a second and, uh, maybe if we, uh, um, um, hold tight, okay, I gotta call you back. Event's here. Crap. Great, great. He said to hold tight. <laughs> I like how you take things so literal, Gordis. I absolutely adore you. Well, what's he doing in there? Damn uh -oh. it! I to turn back on the douchey voice. Get out of my way. Newsflash, asshole. This is my office now. First you give me a body that isn't re- Then you go hacking my computer? What are you doing? You're trying to pull something. I know it. Uh, what, am what I are you doing? What are you doing? Everything in this office is mine now, which technically means you're breaching security. We had a deal, asshole. I tracked Reese and Vaughn all across Pandora for you. I refused them supplies when they needed them. And all you had to do was bring me whatever the hell was living inside Reese's head. I knew what? I shouldn't have trusted you. Of course, you'd betray me. You're only out for yourself. Then why'd you take if the you deal? If you couldn't handle the risk, maybe you shouldn't have taken Vasquez's deal. My I mean, deal. my deal. I am Vasquez in the, uh... So in the first place, maybe you shouldn't have. Weren't Reese and Vaughn your friends? They were dead the second they set foot on Pandora. If I was gonna lose them anyway, I might as well get something out of it. But well, you that... still haven't answered me. Why bring a body that wasn't Reese? 
I can't believe you thought I wouldn't find out. Well, you seriously underestimated You're right. me. You're right. Reese is right. Reese isn't dead. What? I have no idea what's going on here, but I don't like it. I'm calling security. Thank you for calling security. You are the Hey, how you doing? Uh, you, you want get her off that phone if I was you, unless you want to be a bullet sponge. I need your help. I need your yeah. Cool. Time to decide what's mightier, the pen or the punch. All security officers are busy. Uh, Please continue. Uh, uh, reminder, if you have why am I always put with these difficult choices? Please talk it out. And dial emergency medical services. Event. We need to talk. Oh yeah. What about? You got this, pal. Don't. Mess it up or we'll die. Security officers are busy eliminating other threats and will take your call in the order it Everything's received. gonna be fine. Everything is gonna be fine. Okay, by tomorrow you'll be sipping macchiatos with the rest of the galaxy's most morally flexible. That's not your style, Hugo. What are you playing at? I'm a complex, <laughs> awesome man. <laughs> oh, I don't play. That's for children. And I am a complex, awesome man. A man's man. A man's man. man's man. That's a lot of man. Should be humble to stand in my presence. I'll stand wherever I damn well please. God, you're especially sassy. Especially in my own office. Not for long. I don't know what you're up to, but you better make this right and fast. You have my word. Oh, and Hugo, I'm watching you. I can't, I can't bring myself to reveal myself to a vet yet. Just because of what's there? going on. Right? What took you so long? Do you forget that we have, a, you know, a mission to accomplish? Yvette we were Dr. Vasquez. I thought she was our friend. Oh, friends are rare when money's on the table. I'm sorry, yeah. Reese. No. So yeah, Jack's office is on total lockdown and I can't get the beacon. A little help? Uh-oh. I'm working on it. Well, work faster. No beacon means no law means everybody's gonna die. At least we're all doomed together. Yay! Come on, oh, Reese. It'll come to you. <sighs> you know, if I were you in there with the vet, I would've let my stun baton do the talking. Well, that's not quite true. If I were you, I would have bought Yvette a one-way ticket to Strangulation Town with a brief stop. Look, either help or leave me alone. Weird station. Jack, if you're not here to help, get lost. Don't tell me to get lost. You get lost. Uh, I, I can't think when you're talking. I'll, ca I'll call you back. Wait, what? Reef. As I was saying, I'm here to help. Just surprised a handsome Jack fan like you doesn't know I have a trap door in my office. And let me tell you, you're gonna love it. As long as blood doesn't make you squeamish and yeah, maybe some brains and How whatnot. cliche. Not to burst your bubble or anything, but isn't a trapdoor just a little cliche? So is saying burst your bubble, what's your point? <laughs> uh, that I'm surprised a man of your distinct tastes would have one? It's a time-honored tradition used by generations of Hyperion CEOs. You know, I, I feel like you're mocking my culture. It's just a trap door. Jeez. Uh, it's not just a trap door. It's the centerpiece of your new plan. Uh, you're gonna need to go in the out hole while someone yanks the lever. It's not as sexy as it sounds. <laughs> a lot of people died down there. No, what did I agree to? I'm not touching a your lever, Jack. Plan. With my office on lockdown, climbing up the trap door is the only way in. And you get to do it all from the safety of a prison cell. I mean, I I've heard of some killer plans in my time, but this one takes the cupcake. You're pulling my leg, aren't you? <laughs> you're just, you're just pulling my leg, right? Ordinarily, sure. But this is no time for jokes. Not with the event mess and your disguise breaking down. Okay then. Guess that counts as a plan. Gotta go with yeah, it. Yeah, it does. All right. The first step though is to make sure that con artist babe of yours joins you on the prison level, and we're golden. And you can access the jack hole there. The the jack hole. <laughs> Are you serious? The Jack Hole? <laughs> oh, Jack. Tell me you've got a plan. But... I think... This is gonna be a good stopping point for right now. 
So, <laughs> the plan is getting a little deeper, folks. It's getting a little bit more interesting. And it looks like in the next episode, we're going in the jack hole. Whatever that is. It doesn't sound sexy at all. But it's the only way we're going to get our plan underway and taken care of. So that's what's going to have to happen. So in the next one, we'll see what happens. But I hope you enjoyed this episode of Tales from the Borderlands. And I hope you're excited for what's going to happen next. Because I don't know what's going to happen. But we'll find out together. So until then, remember guys, this was Tales from the Borderland, Episode 4, Escape Plan Bravo. I have been Benchez. If you liked the video, push the buttons down below. Let me know what you thought. And I'll see you folks in the next one. I love all your faces. See you next time.